Hey guys, Gabriel with Chrome Unboxed, and today we're talking recovery media. Uh, perhaps you've borked your device and you've got that white screen of death that says uh, insert recovery media, or maybe you're like us and you like to tinker and it's just a good idea to have a backup just in case. So we're gonna show you all the steps on how to install and create a backup for your device. Before we get started, this video is brought to you by NordVPN. It's the VPN of choice for millions of users, whether you're at home, abroad, public Wi-Fi, it will keep your browsing safe and secure. To learn more, go to chromeunbox.com forward slash NordVPN. All right, if you're doing this just as a backup, you can do it from whatever device you want. But if you've actually borked your Chromebook, you'll need a second device to set up the recovery media. So we have an Acer 512 here that we've got on the recovery screen, and we're gonna use the HP 15 to download and create our image. So let's get started on installing. All right, one other thing you're gonna need is a flash drive. Um, you're gonna need at least four gigs. Any flash drive will work. Obviously, if your device only has USB-Cs, you're gonna need an adapter or a USB-C drive. I uh, recommend pretty much any brand you wanna pick up except for SanDisk. For some reason, SanDisk flash drives do not play well with the Chrome OS recovery tool and they are hit or miss. So you're gonna slide over to the Chrome Web Store and you're gonna look up the Chromebook recovery utility. It is by Google. You can see it right there on the offered by. You're gonna install that on your Chromebook and then you're gonna launch it. Now you're gonna be greeted with a screen that tells you the same thing I just did. You're gonna need a flash drive. Go ahead and get started. So this is where you're actually gonna choose the device that you're making the recovery media for, not the one you're doing it on. So you can select the model from a list. Sometimes you might have to use the board name and we'll put a link in the uh, description where you can find all of those board names for your specific device. But just go ahead and click select model from the list. Go to Acer. And then you're gonna keep scrolling until you find the 512. There's a couple different model numbers. They're all the same. It's all the same board. And then from there, click continue. Make sure your flash drive is inserted and then select the uh, media device you wanna use. Right now we have a uh, 16 gig in the drive there. And then next and create now. It's gonna take a few minutes to download and install this. And then when it's done, it'll tell you to eject the device and you're ready to go. It's so moving on to the next Chromebook. You've got your white screen of death there. So you're gonna take your newly Create a recovery media, plug it into the drive, and we wait. Now it's gonna verify the uh, install image, and then in just a few seconds, it will start the recovery process. It doesn't take very long. It's just installing a new version of Chrome OS and uh, making sure everything's verified and safe, and you'll be ready to go. So there you go. Once the uh, recovery is complete, it'll let you know, and you're just going to remove the media, and it will restart on its own. Once it's reboot, you'll have a completely clean, fresh install of Chrome OS. You'll be ready to log in, just like it's brand new. Uh, for whatever reason, this did not work. Maybe your recover media was flawed. Uh, just try it again. Use a different flash drive. You always wanna make sure you have at least a four gig flash drive. And uh, this will work with any device. So once you get into the recovery tool, you'll be able to find any device that, that you have is in the list there. Uh, hey guys, if you found this helpful, give us a thumbs up, click the subscribe button, and don't forget to hit that notification bell because we'll be putting out some more how-tos and tutorials in the near future, and you're gonna wanna check those out. Till next time.